Okay, so now we're going to look at sidestepping and circling in both directions as you jab and making it into a continuous drill, one direction and the other. So I'm here, and I'm going to start, since I'm a southpaw, I'm going to start moving to my right as I jab, triple jab, 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 cross, uppercut, cross, hook, right into a weave. Then I'm going to come up and go jab the other direction, jab, 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 cross, uppercut, cross, weave. Okay? So we're putting that together in one direction and immediately changing direction. The idea here is that when you're jabbing and moving your feet to the side, you're setting up a new angle with, for my cross that is, all right? I can hit between his guard and I won't run into his uh, lead arm, his glove. He usually doesn't notice where my feet are, the, move, the movement of my feet as I'm jabbing either because that the jab has a tendency to obscure his vision. Moving in the other direction, so first in this direction, is awkward, and that's why you gotta train to move that direction. As my weight goes on to my rear foot, jab, 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 cross, up and cut, cross, and weave. All right, so you've gotta learn to move both directions so that you're not predictable. Yeah, okay. 